Hello everyone. Today we will talk about actions in Copilot Studio. In today's demonstration, we will cover these items. What are Copilot actions? Basic example of connector action, advanced example of connector action, Microsoft 65 Copilot connector action, and much more. You can extend the capability of your Copilot by adding one or more actions. Actions are used by your copilot to respond to user automatically using generative actions or you can call them directly explicitly from within a topic. Please note that actions are currently in preview. So functionality is limited and improving based on feedback of consumers. Let's make a custom copilot. Make sure to give good description as good description decide the course of action for copilots. Let's name it weather information. Go to settings. Generative AI and use generative actions. What is weather of Delhi? So it is not able to provide the weather of New Delhi, but it gave a suggestion to refer weather.com. Because we have not defined any topic or any information source to match the weather information. Please notice that under knowledge, we mentioned that allow the AI to use on general knowledge. If we disable this, let's try same query again. This time the answer is no information found because we have disabled to fetch the information from the web grounding. Let me enable this. Same question. So now information is based on web grounding by telling us to visit weather.com for the information. But we want accurate information. So in that case, we have to define an action. Click on action. Please notice that this weather information is a custom copilot made by us. So when you click on action, we'll see option add an action. Click on this one. The default list shown has power output flows, custom connectors available within your environment. This list include commonly used pre-built connectors and bot framework skills that are registered with your copilot. At present, we have no custom connector. Let's choose get forecast for today from Amazon weather. Why are we choosing this one? Because it's a very simple example. In our next example, which is a little complex, we will choose some other connector. Amazon weather connector only access public weather data, so no credentials are required. So we will keep this option as it is. Please make sure Description should be very relevant because based on user query, copilot call one or more actions or topics to produce the output.
let's keep all option default as of now in another example which is quite advanced one we'll explore more options in step 2 you will see input and outputs as of now i'm not modifying any inputs or outputs to keep it simple there are two inputs location and units there are few options which i'll cover later on Similarly, we have outputs. Name and description of input and output is very important for action for selection by copilot. Now you can see now we have an action under this custom copilot how to call this action your action is called automatically in response to relevant user query let's try to call this action in copilot you notice that when i ask for what is weather of new delhi it asked me a second question about unit imperial or matrix because we have two input parameters in action it may ask you for connection first time Now you can see that based on our action, we got the output. So without the need of coding or Power Automate, you're able to build an action and able to call the action from your custom copilot. If you're curious to know more about how it works internally, let me show you. one more option open connection map same query you can see that interaction have two inputs unit matrix and location new delhi and output process by action so we make sure to give good description to your action and give the proper query to copilot you may have seen amazon weather example in many demo sessions on internet so i'll show you one more advanced example for custom copilot custom action Let's go back to actions. Add an action. List all RSS feed items. only one parameter which is the feed url only one output
In the previous example, we have taken the dynamic fill with best option, which is default one. There is one more option, set at value. So how these two options are different? By default, each input is set to dynamically fill with best option. The copilot tries to populate the value from available contacts, such as getting value from user message. If no appropriate value is found, it generates a question to ask for user for a value. Like we have seen in previous example, it asks us for unit like imperial or matrix. You can override input with value by setting a value. Like we have this RSS feed URL for CNN news. We'll put this value over here. Next. Like we have added the input, we can also edit the output. By default, your action is configured to automatically generate a contextual response for a user based on the query and result of the action. We have seen in previous example, we have used this option. We have two more options like create a message you can choose values from variables or functions or you can also use an adaptive card so you have seen that in input we have given the url in output we have used adaptive card let's save it next finish now under this custom copilot we have two actions one for weather and one for news let's test this now show me news You can see that now I have news articles based on our CNN RSS feed. Let's try few more options. Under inputs, we can add more inputs like since. Based on our second input, it's asking us to give the date or month. Now we have only for the August. So we have seen how to create connectors in custom copilots. Click on copilots. If you see copilot for Microsoft 65, you can click on this one. Click on action. If you have license for Copilot for Microsoft 65, you can also create actions for Copilot for Microsoft 65. Click on add action. Unlike custom Copilot, this first party Copilot have many options. Connector, conversational, prompt and flow let's talk briefly about all the four options we will only cover 
connector in this demonstration rest the options will cover in other videos under actions in custom copilot we have seen the demonstration of cnn rss feed let's try same thing under this as well for the purpose of export import we should save in solution it has two actions let's select this action which we used in last demonstration under custom copilot but this time we're doing for microsoft 365 copilot here interface is different from the custom copilot interface other parameters you can keep optional we can fill as per your requirement you can make new connection or you can use existing connections let's create new connection test connection under custom copilot you have done testing of action in copilot studio itself but here you can do testing using grounded chat or in teams click on open to test click on manage copilot response and find yes test rss news feed demo enable this show me news so you can see based on your prompt it reached test rss news feed demo action and found the news based on cnn rss if you are developer you can also see developer info Enable plugin or action, match function, and execution. So, action do the same thing in custom copilots and first copilot like Microsoft 65 copilot, but the way they created and being tested are a little different from each other. Let's go back to action. next we are publishing this action for the all users further access can be managed by admin so this, this action is available under copilot for microsoft 65 let's open copilot so now you can see rss news feed demo enabled so in this demonstration we have covered connector type of action for conversational for prompt and for flow refer my other videos thank you thanks for watching this video i hope you liked it i will be happy to solve your queries further please mention in comment box or refer my website which i have given in description Please subscribe to my channel to see such demonstrations. Thank you.